We talked a bit Friday about uh, force equals mass times acceleration, which is our basic formula that Newton's second law gives us. We rearranged it and talked about the fact that a lot of times it's more helpful for us to have it arranged this way because a lot of times we want to know what an object is doing. And by that we mean, you know, is it accelerating? And if so, how much? And so this is a more helpful way of using that formula sometimes. But another thing we need to realize is that this formula is uh, cleverly disguising another formula that's very similar to, to it and actually means the same thing. If we consider force is equal to mass times acceleration and we talk specifically about the force being a weight, we might write W instead of F for mass. And if we talk specifically about acceleration due to gravity as the acceleration, then we might write G instead of A. And so that formula quickly becomes something that looks like a new formula. But really, this formula down here is the same as this one. It's just W equals mg, weight is equal to mass times the acceleration due to gravity, is a specific version of this formula, force is equal to mass times acceleration.